Frey Hesselen. Oh my god. <laughs> We're butchering the Dutch language. I think the language of love is international, don't you? Well, we're gonna find out. Let's take the quiz, Let's okay? Do it. In Mexico, what do the bride and groom use to toast each other? Hint, you wear them on your feet. I have my own line of these. Heels? <gasps> I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. The bride and groom make a toast using each other's shoes as a wine glass. Did you know that in Mexico? Uh, didn't I didn't know that, that either. Okay, no, 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 next. No. Does fair part mean A, wedding invitation, or B, wedding cake in French? I think it means wedding invitation. How do you know that? I, I don't know. I just Come took on. a guess. Okay. Okay, so okay. true or false. In Italian, there are two different ways to say I love you, depending on if you're talking to a friend or a family member or a lover. Yes That's or true. No? That's true? That's true. True. Of course, of course. You will say ti voglio bene. I hope I said that right. I care mm -hmm. about you to friends and family. And ti, ti amo. Ti voglio bene. Yes, and ti amo to a lover. Ti amo. Okay. <laughs> which country has a wedding tradition in which the groom's family throws Jujubes? What is jujubes? Jujubes? Uh, uh, okay, and chestnuts to the bride and groom. A, Korea, B, Australia, C, Iceland. Australia? No. What is it? Korea! Oh. A groom's family throws jujubes, means sons, and chestnuts mean daughters, in hopes oh. of having their grandchildren and the bride and groom receive them. Oh, cute. That's cute, beautiful. cute, cute. Try to pronounce this Dutch word correctly. It means bachelor party. So, Briegeselen Fest. Briegeselen Fest. Fasted. Oh, fasted. Fasted. Oh, my God. <laughs> We're butchering the Dutch language. Let's okay. not even play with it. Okay. So, We're sorry. During the ceremony in Spain, okay. the groom and the bride will exchange an offering in the form of 13 golden. Uh, A. Uh huh. Rings. B. Fish. C. Coins. I'm gonna go with. I feel like in weddings there's coins. C. Coins. Is that right? You're coins! right! Yes, we got yes. one right! This represents the fact that they'll be providing, sharing their wealth, and taking care of each That's other for right. the rest of their lives. That's right. Well, she, she's correct in every, every no, question. Did I get everything right? No, yeah. I got a couple wrong. <laughs> in which country before the wedding are you supposed to crush your old porcelain saying? Say what? Sherbin bringen gluck, glijuk. It's in Germany. In which country? In Germany! It's in Germany. How did you know that? Well, I have friends from Germany. You do? It yeah. means shards are lucky and it's supposed to bring lifelong luck and health to the bridal pair. There's another one. <laughs> okay. Okay, where in the world would you be if you had lamingtons as your wedding cake? Lamingtons? England? Mm. No? In Australia. Oh, Australia. Australia. Okay. What, uh, not close, okay. Not close at all. <laughs> a lamington is an Australian cake made from squares of butter cake mm. or sponge cake coated in a outer layer of chocolate Ooh. sauce and rolled in desiccated coconut. Oh, that's my favorite. Oh my god. Bueno. That's good. Yeah, I want some mm. of that. What is the most popular day for wedding ceremonies in Las Vegas? Hint! It's dedicated to romance. Oh, that's man. easy. Every yes, that's easy. You get, you get the easy day. ones. Yeah, Valentine's Day, that yeah, is true. Of course. I think we're done. That's it. Goodbye. Done. Done, done, done. <laughs>